Okay, YouTubers, we're gonna do a night video. Now, the only reason I'm doing this is because it's getting dark out and I have to get home, but I figure I can sneak out quick get across this road here. And where I'm headed to is uh, I'm right by an old mine here in Tamaka. I don't mind the traffic. I'm right along the road, so I gotta do this quick. But, uh, This is not a very good YouTube video to do right now. But I feel the light, they'll see me as I kick garbage around. But you can see I'm heading along the road here. Do a little adjustment. And it doesn't look dark on the video, but it's getting dark. But right up here is something I found. I've seen this since I was a little kid. I went in it once. Oh, that must have been 40 years ago. But uh, in the mines up here, um, the regulations, you had to uh, have a second exit. And I think I found one of them second exits, but I'm not sure. But it sure looks like one. Let's go up here. That doesn't go in far. But it's going a good five feet. And it's, it keeps going, but I don't think I can squeeze in here enough. It is hollow back there. Uh, let me just do a little. Let's see what we can see. I'll extend. I'm using a selfie stick. Oh, let's move this broken bottle. Let's just poke in here, see what we can see. Now, I'm not going to be able to see everything in here. What's that down there? It looks like a, a comb. <laughs> I thought it was a snake skin at first, but let's just peek around here. See what we can see. Oh. Easier said than done. Let me reposition this. I know I'm probably making you seasick by moving this camera all around a lot. What I'm trying to get there's a little opening back here. Let me show you that opening quick. See it there on the bottom? Now, if I can maneuver the camera, and I'm shaking all over the place, but let's see what we see down here. that I can see but this is all loose rock here let me get my camera out oh it's tight in here and you see I was in that but look at all this this is all loose rock here see that and there's a bottle here this is all loose material see how that moves Everything here is loose. So this is telling me either this was backfilled in, and of course, there's a little nook back there I can try to zoom in. No, it's hard. I need one of the, but it, to me, it looks like this was opened a little more. It goes back this way a little bit too. Oh, let's see. I love caving, but you gotta watch. Look at the floor, see this? That junk. I don't want to lay on a broken bottle. That would be a terrible thing. Oh wow. It does go back. Even farther than I thought. Ooh, well, that's solid rock. It's good echo here. Watch for spiders, which I don't think they're out today. Ooh, I'm really going back here. Oh wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's about as far back as I can go. As I can show you if I can squeeze the camera by me. Oh, this is tight. There's my feet. Jumping out the side. Oh, I'm stirring up a lot of dust. Uh, that's weird. I don't see this unless I'm looking at the viewer. 
Oops, sorry about the focus. Come on, focus up. There we go. Yeah, that's actually looking outside. I made it. There yeah, he goes over that way. Oh, yeah, it was just in there. Up in there. Wow. Cool. So, ooh, yeah, watch the broken glass, I know. Ah, this could be a nice little shelter. There's the, I forget what mountain that's called. That's Sharp Mountain. But I'm looking at the west. I'm sorry, my direction messed up. East. And Tamaka would be right over in there. But yeah, neat little cave. I've never explored it that much entirely. Ooh. Oh, wow. That's a lot of... Whoa. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, as you can see... It is cavey. I don't know if this was man-made, but from the looks of the way things, things like, yeah. I think this was a second exit. There's all the loose gravel here and rocks on the, you know, even this rock right here. I know that one's pretty solid, but. That one's solid. But all them in there are loose. That's telling me this is backfilled. So it might have pitched down. I don't know. But I'm up on Valley Road here, coming up Hunter Street from Tamaqua. This is right along the road, as you can see. Cars are going by. I don't want to blind them with the light. But if anybody knows for a fact what this was, if this was a second exit, or it's just a natural cave in the mountain let me know either way this was pretty cool so all right i have to head home my wife was waiting for me i told her i'm going to go make a quick youtube video she didn't sound too happy but yes this is so neat i wish i went in farther than i thought last time i only went in that first section there but when i looked over to the right i was like oh I could squeeze in there. But yeah, it is a little claustrophobic. I'm starting to get a little uh, anxiety. Cause, you know, if you, when you're coming out, you're like, oh, you can't see the outside. Reality kind of sets in, like, hmm, hope we can get out. But yeah, very cool, very cool spot. This is only like a mile from my house. I've gone by this road so many times and seen this. Well, now I finally got it on YouTube. I don't think there's anybody else that has YouTube videos on this at all. Yeah, everyone's coming home from work now. But, but be warned though, don't go exploring too far. You do have these posted signs, private property, you know, hunting, fishing, trapping, or trespassing, or any purpose, strictly forbidden. Well, I wouldn't consider that trespassing. I call it exploring. Either way. Let's see, is there a name on here? Oh, I don't know who put that there. All right, well, I'm going to end this video here. Uh, so, if you like this video, if you want to see more videos like this, uh, post on the comments, let me know. And until the next video, take care, and I'll see you then.